We got Eric Cartman best moments, you feel me? Make sure y'all comment down below if y'all want us to react to other, you know what I'm saying, other characters, but our favorite character, Dad. Yeah, I think he's funny. Yeah. Everybody say it's uh, Randy, but me personally, I think it's Eric, you know what I'm saying? I think it's Cartman. Uh, make sure y'all hit that like button, subscribe button, y'all want more South Park. Let's get in the video. <laughs> song I just wrote. It's called I Hate You Guys. I hate you guys. You guys are assholes. Especially Kenny. I hate him the most. Why don't everybody say nothing about reacting to Kenny? I hate yeah. you guys. Come on, you guys know the words. I guess he don't talk. Though. Especially yeah. Kenny. Okay. Considerate messenger blood is reporting, sir. I have a message for you from the battlefield. What battlefield? The Topeka. We're raising all kinds of hell, see? It's probably the most fun I've had in several months. Well, well, you gonna read your message or not? Dear guys, words cannot express how much I hate you guys. As we fight our way northward into the great unknown, only that one thing remains certain. That I hate you guys with every tired muscle in my confederate body. We have taken Topeka, and now I must rally the men onward to Missouri. Because I will not stop until we have won it all. And you guys are my slaves. Because I hate you guys. I hate you guys so very, very much. Yours, General Cartman Lee. Oh, look, children. I think we're entering San Jose, which is the capital of Costa Rica. Oh, this is so exciting. Oh, my God, dude. Look how dirty and crappy everything is. <laughs> Eric, Costa Rica is a third world country. These people are much poorer than those in the U.S. Well, why the hell don't they get jobs? Hey, why don't you people quit slacking off and get a job? What's wrong with you? Go to college. Eric, sit down! Go to you gotta be friends with these people and they just slack off and be poor forever, right, Kenny? Hey, maybe that's it, Kenny. Maybe you're Costa Rican. That's why your family's so poor. <laughs> your family isn't poor? Whoa, dude, look over there! Wow, Costa Rican prostitutes! Hey, look at the prostitutes, you guys! What are you looking at, man? Yeah, why don't you take a picture? Okay. Click. Eric, sit down! Man, Mom, seriously, something wonderful has happened. What is it, Snookums? Mom, look, the tooth fairy. I put a tooth under my pillow, and she gave me two dollars. She's only given me a lousy quarter before. Oh, my. She must think that you are a very special little muffin. Yeah, this is so tits. Don't say tits, Eric. Oh, I mean, this is so cute. Well, perhaps now you should take that money and open up a savings account that has compounded daily interest. <laughs> You can compound daily my ass with interest, Mom. I'm going to the toy store and buy me a skateboard. But, Eric, I think maybe the Tooth Fairy wants you to use that money to learn about saving. Mom, you don't know what the Tooth Fairy wants me to do with this money, okay? You're not the Tooth Fairy. I'll see you later. Aw, oh, man, this is so intense. Here, look. These are squirrel monkeys. Endangered inhabitants of the rainforest. Wow, isn't he neat, Lenny? Bad. Bad monkey. Eric, Damn. what the heck are you doing? I'm asserting myself. It's tough love. Just like my Mitchell Kitty. When he's bad, I say, you got the bad Mitchell Kitty. Now smack him on the head. And here is a three-toed slot. It's bad. It's a bad three-toed slot. Eric, for God's sake, knock it off. Respect my daughter. Hi, are you guys? Jesus Christ, why do we pick the <laughs> bad guy to lift up in there? Hey, he be having him on a straight dummy mission. Camera left, camera left. That's it, not down. What the, who's there? Who is that? I am the Tooth Fairy, my child. Oh, sorry, Miss Fairy. I didn't mean to gaze at you. I'm back asleep now, see? Yes, now I will leave your tidings under your pillow. Oh, gosh, I, I didn't think you'd be so fat. I, come on, fat ass. Do not open your eyes until morning, or else I will kick you in the nuts. Why, the nuts? Y yes, ma'am. Bull crap, I am not following this stupid hippie around anymore. Eric, where are you going? I'm going this way. Young man, I am the adult here, and I say you go this way. Look, you can stay over, nah, but I'm going over, <laughs> nah. Young man, I have had it. No, 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 no. You, nah. Me, nah. Here you go. And again. Good! You deserve to die, you little bastard! Damn. Eric, we have to stay together! Goddamn stupid hippie activist. I should be home nestled in the couch with my Mitchell Kitty right now watching Fat Abbott cartoons and... Yes! I knew it! I'm safe! 
Mister, you gotta help me. I'm starving to death. What are you doing here, little boy? I was with my class, and we got our lost in the rainforest, and I need some food. I'm fading fast. Lost in the rainforest? Oh, my lord. Where are all the others? Food. I have to have food. Oh, my god. Get this child some food, quick. Chicken wing. Chicken, Chicken wing. wing. Medium spicy. Let's see, Jesus got crucified, then he died, then three days later he had his erection. Okay, there's 14 stations of the cross. Oh, it says we can make costumes out of sheets. This is gonna be fun. I'm gonna be Jesus. You're too fat to be Jesus. Oh, and like you're gonna do it, Jew? Stan should be Jesus. Bam. Either I'm Jesus, or I'll screw you guys. I'm going home. You're such a fat baby. Well, I guess you guys can do the stations of the cross by yourselves. You can be Jesus, you tubby crybaby. Sticks and stones may break my bones, but I'm Jesus and you aren't. Save big and win on the shoe carnival holiday savings express. Shut up about that. Doc Martens. Nobody cares about you. Mom, please, can we just leave? You have to see the eye doctor, Eric. But I hate the eye doctor. He always makes fun of me for being fat. You're not fat. You're big bone. That's what I told him, but he doesn't listen bone. to reason. Eric Cartman. <clears throat> Hello, Eric. Hi, Dr. Lard. How's my little piggy today? Hey, don't call me a little piggy! I just say that because you're my little buddy. Kiss it for an item, all right? Keep the fat joke to yourself. Hop up on the chair. Don't break it now. God damn it! Just kidding. Let's see how your eyes are doing. All you have to do is read the letters. Can you see the letters? Yes. All right, read them out for me. I am a little piggy. <laughs> that does it! Man. No, no, that, that was just a weird coincidence. I did not know how that happened. I am a little piggy. Wow, what are the odds of that? Discuss. Due to recent events around the country, I've been instructed to teach you all about sexual harassment in school. About what? Now, does anybody know what sexual harassment means? Yes, Eric. When you're trying to have intercourse with a lady friend and some other guy comes up and tickles your balls from behind. No, Eric, that's not what I'm talking about. <laughs> hey, that went really well. They really liked it. Yeah, I told you I'd be a sweet Jesus, you guys. Oh man, at least the real Jesus didn't weigh 400 pounds hey, up no. there as a broken glass. This spot looks good. Uh. Yeah, that looks pretty good. Okay, cool. See you, Carmen. Hey, wait, where the hell are you going? I don't know. I'm going home, I guess. Yeah, me too. Well, get me down from here. Carmen, how stupid are you? Didn't you read the Bible? We have to leave you up there until you die, and then you come back to life in three days. What? Yeah, dummy, you have to get an erection. Then I can give it to my dad. All right, let's get down to business, shall we? Uh, gee, that's a good idea. My mom isn't paying you to be a comedian. Hmm. Let's see, which is better, one or two? One or two? They look exactly the same. Just pick one, or two. I don't know, two. Okay, one or two, one or two. Uh, one. One or two, one or two. Two. No, the answer is one, Piggy, one. Ow, I hate Ew. you. Yes, there's obviously a problem with your eyes. I'm going to have to dilate them and run some tests. Probably another professor. I don't want to be Jesus anymore. Don't leave me here, you guys. All right, that does it. Screw you guys, I'm going home. Okay, I'm getting pissed now. Dude, what are we gonna do for New Year's Eve? It has to be awesome. I know, it's probably gonna be the biggest night of our lives. You guys, you guys, guess what? What, fat ass? I've become a man. <laughs> I started puberty, you guys. What? No, you didn't. Yes, I really did. How do you know? Well, because yesterday, I got my period. You got your what? My period, oh, yes. You see, there comes a time in every child's life when they grow up and nature starts to take its course by having you bleed out your ass for a few days every month. You're making that up. Miss Alton, what's it mean to get a period? Well, boys, I don't think I can tell you. Uh... Please, it's important. Well, it's when puberty hits and you bleed, you know, down there. Holy shit, dude! Carpen's right! Well, guys, I'm afraid I won't be able to hang out with you on New Year's Eve. I have to hang out with the older crowd because now I'm mature. I got my period and you got did it. I got my period and you got did it. All right, so we got the test results back, Piggy. Stop calling me Piggy! You've got a small stigmatism that's causing all the problems. So what does that mean? It means, Piggy, that your eyesight is never going to get better. All right. Right now, I'm going to be totally serious here. Okay. If you call me Piggy one more time, I'm gonna leap out of this chair and rip your goddamn nuts off with my bare hands! Well, don't worry, I've got something that's going to make your eyes as good as new. <laughs> oh, dude, Did you super have to weak. Those? I'm not Did wearing you have to these. Those? The guys would totally rip on me. I know, the hardest you know thing to do is. Like when you're, uh, 
Like when they like, I think they, they dilate your eyes or something. Oh, the shit. black. Yeah. I ain't never had to do that shit either. I ain't trying to do that shit. Oh, I don't shit. Like I don't, I, I ain't never, I only seen one part of uh, Zero Night. I only seen that happen like one time. Oh, her. she did? Yeah. I, only seen I think like that's what it is. Kids to wear their glasses. I'm just gonna take them off as soon as I leave. That's why we have the little stapler. Ow! Son of a bitch! Okay, so just to set the record straight here, the fight will be happening out by the tetherball pole at 3.30. Tweak just weighed in at 48 pounds, Craig at 45. Uh, how long do you expect the fight to last? Uh, yeah. However long Craig wants it to last. <laughs> <laughs> make, make no mistake, Craig has been ready for this fight since day one. He doesn't even view it as a challenge. He'll view it as a challenge when he's getting his ass kicked. Uh, did you hear that? It sounds like diarrhea coming out of someone's mouth or something. Shut up, fat ass! Don't call me fat, you son of a bitch! Okay, Muffin, Mommy's leaving now. You do what the babysitter tells you, okay? Uh-huh. Be good. Right. Come give Mommy right. Eskimo kisses. Ah, uh, ma. Eskimo kisses for Mommy. Jesus Christ. Bye, kids. Well, go put that pizza in the oven, bitch. I'm hungry. Ow! All right, turd. Listen up. Now that your mom is gone, I'm in charge. I don't know how you treat your other babysitters, but when I'm babysitting, you're nothing but a little Man, turd. Universe. You're a stinky, dried up, stupid turd. Got it? You can't hit me. Didn't you see those nanny videos on TV? My boyfriend is coming over, so you go to the kitchen and you make us that pizza before I snap you in half like the little turd stick you are. You're not allowed to have people over. Move! Oh, crap. oh yeah, dude, just get in her the jaw. Figure it out, the whole line and shit, the braces, yeah, that shit hurt. Tell him. Okay, let's get started. Oh, yeah, You're here for the liposuction, right? <laughs> oh, look out the glove! All right, time to laser me a little piggy. Hey, you son of a bitch! I'm not getting squirting. I bet his mom wishes she could do that. Okay, our next contestant is Eric Cartman. All right, Eric, here is your word. Chair. Chair. Come on, Phonics Monkey Drum. Come in. Eric, your word is chair. Uh, definition? Something you sit on. Country of origin? English! Could you please use it in a sentence? Oh, for Christ's sake, kid, the word is chair! Uh, chair. C-H-A-R-E. God damn it, how come I get the hard one? Get over here, you son of a bitch, Bonix Bucky! Eric, your little friends are here. Mom, Mom, you want to see what I want for Christmas? Eric, it's only Halloween. That's only 72 shopping days left for you. Come on, fat ass, we have to go. <laughs> hey, don't call me fat! <laughs> Man, don't laugh. I'm sorry, hon. I can't go with you guys right now. Yes, you can, Porky. <laughs> Man, does it? Oh, that's not funny, boys. Eric isn't fat. He's big bone. He must have a huge bone in his ass, then. <laughs> <laughs> God damn it! Oh! Wow, he died. Oh, now we just gotta wait for his erection, and I can give it to my dad. Hey, there you guys are. Cartman, you guys are in big trouble. Now get me down from here. How come you're not dead yet, Cartman? You guys? I am seriously. Get me down right now. Look, fat ass, after you die and get resurrected, <laughs> you'll have all kinds of superpowers just like you. Stuff for that shit. Really? Yeah. So hurry up and die, you piece of crap. When I get my superpowers, I'm gonna use them to smoke you two assholes right off the planet. Yeah, superpowers are sweet. Dude, he's still not dead. You guys, my mom is totally worried about me. You better let me down. She's not worried about you. Yes, she is. I've been hearing her all day. Listen, listen. Eric, Eric, where are you? I miss you very bad. That's not your mom calling. Yes, it is, you guys. I'm seriously. This is Eric's mom and I want him here right now. How stupid do you think we are? Now you die on that cross and get resurrected before I kick your ass. You guys, it's too hot out now. I can't do this. He is right. It has been really hot. Like yeah, I noticed that too. Let's go get some ice-cold lemonade. Yeah. Oh, God damn it. You guys, you guys want to hear my I hate standing Kyle song? I hate standing Kyle. That's my grandma. Well, let's dig her up. Wait, I don't know if this is cool. Of course it's cool. She'll be all rotted and scary. I don't think my mom would want me doing this. Oh, I don't want to dig up my dead grandma because I'm such a dirty two-shoes. Ow! You 
guys be quiet. Now, do you want to get back at the fifth graders or not? I don't really care, dude. Yes, you do. Now, dig. <laughs> okay, it's almost open. Ready? I'm counting you. How many years don't match up? That shit a look. Look. Oh, I see it. I see it. I see it. No, I see it. Oh, uh, Yeah, I was looking at that shit wrong as hell. Yeah, I was like, <laughs> the word. I was like, what? Okay, it's almost open. Ready? One, two, three. Whoa, dude. Oh, my God. Hi, Grandma. All this time on the fat stored up in your body? Yeah, and when I get down from you, I'm gonna kick you both right in the nuts. They wrong for that shit. <laughs> nah, that shit fried. Make sure y'all uh, comment down more at South Park. We can definitely check it out. Y'all already know what it is. Make sure y'all hit that like button, subscribe. Definitely appreciate y'all for tuning in and watching this shit. Actually, catch y'all next time.